I'm Evo Tez and welcome back to my playthrough of Horizon Forbidden West. Like the content? Please, like, comment, subscribe. I'm still kind of going back and forth with what I want to do. We'll figure it out in this video. Still undecided. But I do want to finish this mission off at one more I was heading up to. Where are we? Find Kel. Obviously, in this area with all these birds. Really want to replace this bow. Want to replace this weapon and this. I would like to get a rope cast through it in the middle. house thing thinking in there's Kel what's she holding I going anywhere take the loop for trying to talk to her and freaking Jumping over. Now everyone knows. It was only a matter of time once you went up that cliff. You stood right next to the man whose wife you had murdered and told him to move on. I never wanted any of this to happen. Then why? Calais sowed the seeds of discord. She wanted the Utaru to leave Plainsong, abandon our home. If that thought caught on, it would have been more destructive than any sickness or machine. So you had her killed? There was a natural order to all things. Growth, decay, death. It's the way of the world. A tree cannot pick up its roots, so I stopped what was threatening us. And I'm sorry it came to it, but it's over now. I'm gonna make sure you pay for all the suffering you've caused. Too late. And for all the uh, people that she's killed as well, you know, Aloy. That's kind of mean. No. And they remember you ends with still failed. Two people dead. At least you're paying with your life. My choice. All of this was your choice. No. She needed to stand trial. Kalai deserves justice. She's dead, Bree. That's justice enough. It isn't much, but... I want you to have this, as thanks. I won't have to spend the rest of my days wondering what happened to Kalai. Blighted are the leaves. Three of our people, dead. And for what? I admit it. I never wanted you among us. But now, it seems I must thank you for revealing the rot that had taken hold here. I'm sorry it had to happen this way. At least with the rot removed, new growth can thrive. Nice. Go point throw. Nice. That's cry drift there, razor tape. Where was I hitting that? Actually wanted to do the mission up here. That was the mission I wanted to do. Actually, thought there was. Let's uh, do a free fast battle after we progress time. Yeah, I don't really care for all these fake paints that much. 
I am more interested in the skill point else. Okay, river him. I should look for Nilo. Give him the Scarlet Stems. The herbalist in Plain Song said he might be near the Memorial Grove. Home is it's safe, chasing Nilo. and I am never leaving it again. Uh, hi there. Nora, here. You're a long way from home. I suppose I am. I'm looking for an herbalist named Nilo. I think I heard you say his name. You've come to the right place. His seeds were buried here where he tended the blooms of others, including my mother's. I'm his daughter, Gia. How long has he been gone? Some five years now. He put a lot of love into this grove, almost as much as he gave me. That's why I could never abandon River Him. I'd like to leave some flowers, if I may, from an old friend of his. Scarlet stems. They're rare in these parts, but they were his favorite. I never knew why. He planted them whenever he could, but never picked them. Preferred to just watch them bloom. Sounds about right. So he was a good man who led a full life? He was. And he did. I don't know who this old friend is, but if my father liked them, they must be a good soul. Gosh, I hate these ones where you have to go back and forth. How far away it is. We get this nasty weather again. Look, the Outlander's back. I can still see well enough, girl. Is my long vigil over? You have word from my grandmother's gardener? Yes and no. I laid the scarlet stems at his grave. His favorite flower, according to his daughter. Always love to watch them bloom. He's gone. But he did think of me over the years. That'll have to be enough. Really? That's it? Are you sure you got the right guard... herbalist? Huh. Seemed like you thought it was a fool's errand. Well, it's just that it meant something to you. It could have been a whole other life. Could have been. But this life hasn't turned out so bad. I even have a granddaughter who cares enough to come looking for me out in the wilds. And I've still got scarlet stems to remind me of Nilo. Sounds like your grandmother's got it all figured out. Maybe she does. Just tell me the next time you want to come out here, okay? Instead of disappearing? Maybe I will. Here, Outlander. Take this. For helping an old woman to remember she was once young. Ancient bright bracelet. Particularly it is. Again, what about that skill point? Alright, you know what? I get to this location right back. All right, we made it to um, this camp right here. Okay, here, as soon as I made it over to this location here, um, there was someone with all these rumors and the uh, 
Anyway, we got all these quests again. <laughs> I keep getting all these quests, but I kind of want to carry on with the story as well. It's a little rough. Not gonna lie. Keep going back and forth, but there are, you know, what I want to do. Damn. This must be Fall's Edge. Tell us that I can resupply here and head for the Pun Ferry. Did the enemy give you any trouble out there? Welcome, Outlander. Is there a camp in here? Only the one outside. I'm telling the truth. Listen to him, Aroke. Deca, what's going on? Chest. Aloy, I'm glad you're here. This is Aroke, leader of Fall's Edge. So you've enlisted the chief's champion in your dull-bladed efforts. You must be Cavo, then. My grandson. And a soldier trying to right his mistakes. Or trying to lure us into a trap. My scouts caught him, sneaking around on the outskirts of the village. I wasn't sneaking around. I was coming to warn you. The rebels are planning an attack. They're going to send a machine straight through this village. I left my post when I realized what they were planning. You have to believe me. Where are the rebels now? They were hunting for the machine north of here. I, I can show you the way. The only thing you'll do is face trial by combat. You betrayed your clan. Your chief. Blood and blades will decide your fate. I'll fight whoever you want, after we stop the attack. If Cavo is telling the truth, this whole village is in danger. We have to find and stop these rebels. The rebels built a campfire north of the river, near the cliffs. I can show you the way from there. Okay. Open it up, or okay? No. I won't give him the chance to escape. The traitor stays here until his trial by combat. Then I invoke blood for blood. I will take Cavo's place until he returns. You're making a mistake, Chaplain. The clan needs your guidance, not the lies of this bare-armed boy. The right has been called. Cavo will go with Aloy. Then I'm going to. If the boy speaks truth, you'll need my blade. If he lies, I'll run him through. I must make arrangements here first. Then I'll bring the boy to the meeting place. Fine. I'll see you there. All right, can I get this chest now? Let me get the chest. Was there something else? I should go. See you at the camp. The marker for. Here we go. Have a look. You know what? We are gonna do this. Didn't click this campfire, but it gave it to me. Take it. I hate how there's question marks. Okay, it falls edge behind me. Just gotta head west until I reach the coast. Quinn Ferry. Question marks, especially when we know what they are, like the cooking and the healing thing. Get up there. I'm a big fan of these villages. It's difficult to navigate. Yeah, see, it's just the stash. It's nothing important. I'm gonna fast travel to the campfire after we cook to this hunter. 
see what they got a purple weapon. All right, we got a freeze bow. Goodbye. We've got a trip caster, which actually looks really nice. Fortunately, we don't have an elemental or strider circulate. Buy one. Pick these outfits. Why not? It's funny, as soon as you get the, the legendary outfits, everything else just be, and even the weapons, everything else just becomes redundant. You know where I am. All this sweat, and I'm still not cooling off. Takes away from build diversity and such, because you're not really using what you find. See, it's not a raining just like that. Campfire that Cavo mentioned should be nearby. What's taking so long? They should be here already. <sighs> Rebels. Friends of Cavo's. Going to have to take them out to get to that campfire. Take a few steps. Rebels waiting to ambush whoever showed up. Cavo has some explaining to do. Better wait at the campfire for him and Oroke. Take all the stuff first. Maybe we should have listened into them a little bit longer to know what they were up to, but. Good. Take all their valuables. Don't well, let me do anything. There we go. Found a few of your friends when I got here, Cavo. You're not off to a great start. They must have been out on patrol. I swear on the ten, I didn't know they'd be here. What did I tell you? His lies are an open sore. Better we cauterize it now than let it fester. No! I'm telling the truth! Untie him. As you say. But this is a mistake. And my weapon? If you think... Just give it to him, or okay? We need to get moving. Lead the way. I bet a cook can do something with this. Oh yeah, I forgot about the meal. Up this way. Where are you leading us? The rebels are stationed at the nearby cliff falls. I took this path when I left my post. The others won't be expecting anyone to come this way. 
Or they are, and will be skewered the moment we arrive. There's the Cliff Falls. And there's no one there, as I suspected. Let's just keep going. I don't like this. Collisions are a little annoying. everyone no rebels no machine what did i say? over there by the falls Blood of the ten. let us get the fire against it the falls edge the village stands no chance then we stop them right here on your lead aloy nothing will stand in our way now grab your gear we march on falls edge <laughs> around here have a oh my god that ain't weapons Us, and we died. Don't let this break you. Where is everyone? No rebels, no machine. What did I say? Over there. Alright, the you know what? We are gonna kill some of these rebels. Blood of the dead. If that thing runs through Falls Edge, the village stands no chance. Then we stop them. Right here. <laughs> Nothing will stand in our way now! Grab your gear. We march on Fall's Edge. I don't want to shoot green thing with those, but...
honestly thought that was a braking thing and it was it put fire down below instead in the middle have helmets on did it i mean the enemy wasn't difficult just i think i had a little bit too much hitting me at the last time although i think i split more off that enemy last time than i did this time on top of it. That's the loot. I mean, I was hanging there on the side. You should climb up the damn thing. I got the majority of the better loot. Cavo, you're bleeding. I'll be fine. What matters is the attack was stopped. Because of your warning. You saved many lives today. Come on. Let's get you back to Falls Edge. I guess I cracked some ribs, too. Go on ahead. I'll see him back to the village. Okay. I'll let Decca know what happened. Now there's some serious control. Oh. 
Emoth was pretty cool though. Some cool attacks. Three leave, only you return? What happened? Cavo was telling the truth. The rebels had a behemoth. Cavo was injured in the battle, but we stopped the attack. Aroke regrets that he doubted the boy. Your grandson proved himself to be honest and brave, Chaplain. He's loyal to the Lowland. So you'll release him? Well, he's earned his freedom. But it'll take many more deeds to earn back the rest of the clan's trust. I'll do whatever it takes. Thank you, Aloy. Indeed. Falls Edge owes you a great debt. May this begin to repay it. Thank you. What you give us like as five shards? I have so much to show you. Welcome back, Cavo. All right, we are perimeter tripcaster. Look at this. All right, well, it's better than the one that we've got on. That's fire and shark. One's fire, shark, and explosive. I don't want to put this blastling on as well. The thing sounds really cool. It's only a green. I'd rather have something a little better. A trip cat. Fuck one. Would have been nice to have shock on there. Build up. I want on. Hey, we're still looking for Alva. We still got another twenty two hundred distance this is to go. Running past this camp. Rounds, all right. Yeah, we'll be back when we get closer. All right, well, we have a survey drone here, but I'll be back for that. Keep thinking it's one of those birds. Anyway, we're close to meeting her. There she is. Aloy, I'm here. Thornmarsh. Quite a sight, isn't it? Never thought I'd find myself this deep in Tanakh territory. Have you run into any trouble? I've been keeping my head down. Had to duck into the swamps a couple of times to avoid Tanakh patrols. Well, I'm here now, so spill it. Who is Amatis, really? We met out in the wilds, after I was wounded on a hunt. He healed me, then helped me put a stop to a hunter-killer machine that was threatening a nearby village. At first, he thought I was just another hunter from the lodge who only cared about the biggest machine trophy. And I thought he was just a grouchy hermit living in the woods. But then, he trusted me with the truth, 
told me how the Red Raids took everything from him. Seeing that side of him, I don't know, changed things. You love him, don't you? I think I might, yeah. Then why did you part ways? When he told me how he failed to save the woman from his past, I told him how I made peace with my father and brother's deaths. He realized he needed to do the same on his own. Wait. When we searched that Red Raid's battlefield together, you said he'd lost someone close to him there. I thought you meant a fellow soldier. She was. Women aren't allowed to serve in the Karja army, but Nessa disguised herself so she could. Amadis kept her secret. When he left to come out west, he promised he'd send word that he was all right, but his letter never came. So you set out to find him. And when we do, I'll have words for him for leading us on this wild goose chase. Well, at least I kind of understand now. Amadis thought Nessa died on the battlefield, but when he learned that the Tanakh took prisoners back west, he kept going. So I guess now we find this prison, the Rot. I did some scouting while I was waiting. I think I might have found the way. Lead on then. Do you think Nessa might still be alive? I doubt it. Any Karja prisoners from the Red Raids would have been killed or returned home by now. Then what's Amadis after? I think he just needs this to know. Cook? What's this? So we do have this campfire here and survey drone is there, so where she's leading. He beat the Dawn Marsh. We have a lot of medicinal berries. I always loot them whenever I see them. Really? I always loot them whenever I see them. I feel like I don't have enough. Huh. Over here, you flaming hunter. Crap. That's him. Fire calls right on his heels. He's no match for it alone. Come on. Got you. Trigger those crabs. Hit it with three demo. Three. Another big fire close. Oh, you. Unfortunately, my freeze is not very cold.
How, how did that even hit me? Can I not stop it? Oh, I was trying to get him to trigger all that. Yeah, I can't really stop the, uh... ...thing it's saying. Yeah, the Valor Surge. Once it starts, it's going. Well, I haven't used it much, so... Up for that. That's something, I guess. When I did use it, I only had one charge of it, so... Uh, I'm very obvious there in the middle. I honestly thought I stripped more off him, but I don't see anything anywhere. Talana, I. You were supposed to let me know you were okay. I was going to send the message right after I crossed into the desert with an Osaram caravan. But when it became clear that the tunnel had collapsed behind this, I figured the only thing I could do was press on. Seeing as you found a way out here, however, clearly I was wrong. I'm sorry. The last thing I wanted was to worry you. So, you must be Amadis. And you must be Aloy. Talan has told me a lot about you. And I guess you must know about me. Uh, a little. We know you're headed for the rot, but what are you hoping to find there? A clue. Or a shred of one. Anything about Ness's fate. Maybe she died on the battlefield. Or maybe she wasted away in that prison. Either way, I have to know. Well, we're here now. So let's head to the rot. I can't ask you to come with me. I feel bad enough you've come this far. I didn't come all this way just to leave you now. We'll see this through together. I know better than to try to talk you out of it. Come then. The rot's not far. The rot's along the shore, but we'll have to stick to the woods to avoid being seen. That is like you a find crazy it? crapper though. I overheard a Tanuk patrol from the nearby village talking about it. Figured Perhaps he had laid down. There. What were you gonna do if we hadn't found Wait, Talana! You seem to have lost your friend. What? Literally right behind you, buddy. Going backwards? Yeah, this campfire. I've never been here before. Came this way and I want to go to Thorn Marsh. They're waging civil war against the rest of the Tanakh. They must have taken over the prison. Then they would have killed any of the guards. They were my last hope of finding out if Nessa was there. Maybe not. There might still be some clue inside. Even after all this time? Aloy can see much more than you or I. And let's do it. Any scrap of hope is better than nothing. We'll have to find another way in. The front gate looks impenetrable. And there's no way we're scaling those walls. You two stay here. I'll see if I can find another way in and get that gate open. I should check around the sides. Might be a way in from the water. Yeah, in the next one. I'm going to come over here and save, but thank you so much for watching. Catch you then. We're almost here. Almost here. Alright, yeah, catch you then.